Hello, this is Steve Goggins of Elite FTS. I'm also the coach of Goggins Force. This is my training for September the 1st, the 3rd, a few days. Uh, first day was Monday, I did bench. I worked up to 363 for five. For me, that's about 80. 82.5 to 85 percent depending on how I feel. I uh, felt pretty easy. Workouts are going good. I did down sets of uh, 341 for five and 319. Everything felt real good. Bench is going real well. I hadn't squatted in quite a while. It's been probably like six. Five to six weeks since I back squatted. I've been doing some front squats lately uh, just to get back in uh, my quads back in condition. Back squats bother my hips a lot. I want my left hip. And, uh, trying to work it out. Hip mobility. So I uh, decided to squat this week. Hadn't squatted in six weeks. Been doing front squats like I said. Uh, work, working here with 165, warming up. This is 242. Trying to get Trying to work depth after I'd already stretched out, uh, warmed up for probably like 20, 25 minutes, Deeper. trying to get loose. Um, Better. It felt pretty good actually for not squatting a while. My depth is still around parallel, questionable. Uh, in weeks to come, it should get there, it should get pretty good. My goal is to train for rum, uh, raw unity again next year. Hopefully I can be in better shape than I was this past year. Good. A little bit better. I also have a meet coming up uh, on the 20th you so go. the 19th of this month. Mm -hmm. Maybe a deadlift challenge. Uh, kind of entered that late. I want to get in there and see what I can do, see what my deadlift is. Uh, having fun. Just enjoying lifting. Here's 462. I'm getting a little bit. Things are starting to feel a little bit better. Hips are loosening up a little bit. Still at the bottom, you can see my knees probably go forward just a little bit still. Get get down. The bottom. There you go. Forward. Trying to work on that and work on getting as deep as possible. Opening up my hips. These sets were done raw, no belt and no sleeves. No kind of briefs. Like that. This is 518. Feels really well for not having squat. I'm really pleased with this workout. I was very, very happy. My depth will come with time. We'll get better. I can't ask anymore. Let's work out. This is 580. I took this for a single. Uh, first time in a while I've had this much weight on my back. Probably this year, especially raw. I mean, knee wraps. It actually felt pretty good. There's no problem. I could have did a set of three or five reps if I wanted to. But with my body, I don't particularly care to do that. Here, Paul squats. I did a set of three, four, seven. Dropping down. This is one of my favorite assistance exercises. Paul squats. I love them. I feel like they help build speed out of the hole. And for me, I'm still right at parallel. I'm not getting as deep as I want to get. I'm sitting in the hole. But in time, it will get deeper and deeper. I finished off with some light front squats. This is what I have been doing. The past two weeks, I went up to like 450 on front squats. The harness, it felt very good. So right now, I um, just wanted to stay light. Didn't want to go heavy after doing the weight on my back. And I'll probably back squat. Um, Twice a month. Once a month, depending on how I feel. And hopefully by the end of the year, I should be you know, pretty heavy. I'm going to get get my raw squat up. Uh, hopefully over 700. By the end, you know, close to by the end of the year, up even sooner. We just have to see and play it by ear. I guess if you don't squat but once, a, once or twice a month, it kind of runs out of weeks and time. It'll get there. This is my last set of front squats. Just stretching my hips out. Here I can get a little bit below parallel. Feel pretty good. Thank you guys for watching my video. 
following my log. Um, I'll try to do some more video logging. Do it that way. And if you got any questions, just send me an email at GogginsForce.com. Thank you very much.